Hello everyone and welcome back to Empires of the Undergrowth. Friends here as always and well last episode we managed to get our main area with these little guys. Wait, seven? How's there seven? One, two, three, four. No, never mind, never mind. Why is there like music like that going on? Should I be worried? <laughs> right, so we got these guys going out, to picking up these. What we might do is work on a secondary bunch and then have three armies sort of this. So let's have a wee look. We do have 33 of this that we could use, so I mean, we could put it the opposite end of the food. But what we want to do is make that the food. Just so we make sure we have enough for that. So what we'll do is we then do this. And then do this. And that. Do is we'll take it right to the edge there, and then we'll just place these guys all in. And you see our territory, we've only got four more that we can actually use now, which is a bit of a shame, but oh well. Uh, let's do that. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17. There we go. That'll give us 18 in total down there. Right, what we want to do then is we want to extend these guys out a little bit. Oh, we don't have any more to build. Uh, okay. Fair enough, but that gives us 20 on either side. So what we'll do is we can actually use this to go up there and use that to go up there. Did you guys get that? Yes, you did. We can bring these guys back down and have them just at the door, in case, you know. Let's have a look. We've got a lot of food, so we can actually do some upgrades. I don't think we can actually do any... Oh, no, we do that. I don't think we've got any upgrades on this just now. No. And as you see there, we can actually take this and we can do challenge mode. So the log is also home to some fascinating burrowing creatures that will make nest building an extra challenge. So, of course, you can see that there. And if we went medium, so on and so forth. You go insane if you want. You know, what's this? Hmm. So it's just a burrowing creatures, huh? Test the the farm because kind of will it survive whatever the scientists have planned? This will unlock the next missions. Hmm. I am not sure <laughs> if it would or not. That's the only thing. Uh, these guys are here. Let's get this upgraded. And these. You. I don't trust that chat. I don't trust them not to kill me. <laughs> Go. I mean, there's still food up there? Oh, there's still a little bit of food actually. Huh. Uh. Probably gonna definitely need to redo some levels, maybe in the challenge mode, just to see. Because I don't trust them not to try and kill us. Population, max population. Well, 20 and 20, and then we have 7 of these guys. We can actually put more of them in. Maybe put one just there as well. That'll give us 12 in total. So, what we're going to need to do is probably do a challenge. You know, let's see. You know, let's turn on challenge and we'll choose a medium difficulty and let's see how this goes. Probably really wrong. We'll soon find out. Alright, so, let's see. I said from digging is free and there is no tech tree. These levels. Oh, wait, that's just the same thing. And vulnerable. Her first brood will need to move quickly if the colony is to survive. Don't you worry, we'll be okay. Now is to find food. And there is plenty around, but there are other hungry creatures down here. The workers will need to be vigilant. Let's see. They're up there. The ants have encountered a pocket of woodworm. These defenseless weevil larvae will make an excellent meal for the colony. They will be butchered and carried off for processing. Well, it's carried off for processing. It's like, yeah, okay. That doesn't sound horrifying at all. the queen chose her colony's home poorly. 
Hmm? This earth is infested with Grillatalpa, Grillatalpa. A what, what? European mole cricket. A what now? Growing up to 45 millimeters in length and with powerful forelegs, these beasts are masters of tunneling. The crickets have had their fill of roots for the day and are now on the hunt for protein-rich invertebrates. Oh. This queen and her brood are in imminent danger of being devoured. Yeah, cheers game for giving me that sort of thing to think about. You better kind. You guys go there. Just do your thing. Yeah, up there. Oh, that's that's uh, gonna be a tricky one, isn't it? Let's see. We have that there. Yeah, that'll be where our army is going to be. Oh, we can only put one. Never mind then. Hmm. Yes. Well, we know that game. We placed one anyway. There's two, and let's see, we do want to go and get this. Where is this thing going to come in? Is it just going to appear, or is it... Hmm. Not sure I like that. <laughs> oh, dear. So, last time we had spiders, and this time we've got some mole thing that wants to eat us. Ugh. <laughs> one there, one there. This nope. colony must remain small for one now. There, and Food one there. Too scarce to support great That'll enemies. give us ten on them. There we go. Excellent. Now we just need to focus on these guys. There we go. That'll give us two more. That'll give us four altogether, and we do need to look to attacking something soon. Now that's got three in there. That's got two. Probably could take it, actually, to here. Let's not put it that way. You guys get in there. And yellow, actually. You know what? Just bring yellow in there because we should be okay to take these guys on. Go. The workers have go. uncovered carnivorous larvae of Ochipasolens, the devil's coach horse. Oh, we should do be easy to do this. There we go. One down. Powerful slicing mandibles for chopping up their prey. Excellent. They are still small, however. And must undergo a final pupation before their armor is fully right, there developed. There we go. If the okay, if we want to try and maybe go for this one next to overwhelm these critters. What we will do is get another one of these guys. I mean, let's get two in there though, so we might end up better going for that one. Let's go for that, actually. What now? More crickets will burrow onto the nest periodically, more frequently in higher numbers as uh, the level goes on. Dust will fall on the location they will arrive before they appear. Into the nest. The what? ants must mount a defense quickly, Where? or their brood will be forfeit. Oh dear. Hello. Oh my god. Oh Jesus. Huge. How am I meant to kill this thing? Oh, what, really? Game? That doesn't seem fair. Oh man. We're still able to hatch some, but four has gone down, three. Oh, come on, come on. Oh. Kill something. Oh, just kill these the two, come on. Starving. There's not enough food to feed them. Those things are huge. If the ants had disturbed the adults of these larvae, the outcome for the colony may not have been so fortunate. Oh yeah, they sure, game, thank you. Ocean. Oh, right, at least we know what that kind of looks like. And it's quite telling as well. It's not like, you know, a little bit of dust and it's like, where, where, where is it coming from? It's actually quite telling. Though that thing hurt. Okay, let's see. And plus, it brought two, well, those two came round at the awkwardest moment ever. Let's get you over there. Bring you over there too. Maybe do an upgrade in some the of these. have done all they can to prepare this brood chamber. Let's get one of them upgraded. No more goodies over there, so we're going in this way. Just 
There are Hello. In the nest. How you doing there? How you doing? Let's get this and that'll give us enough money to get a few extra goodies. There we go. Right. Pick that all up. Great. Thank you. Can get another one of them. Maybe open this up more. And now what we want to do is possibly go up to this bit again. Just like we've done before. Bring these over there. Got everything from there? Yes, we do. Right. Let's do this. Keep up with them. I mean, we're going to need to... There's nothing coming in there, Predators so... Predators are loose in the nest. The larvae must be protected. Don't worry, it would be fine. As I pan across and look for stuff that's trying to kill me. <laughs> I think we've lost some. Yeah, we have actually lost some of them. We've only got seven of them, but there we go. Excellent. Someone get that, please. Go on. Go on. There you go. Alright, next up, uh, this. These wood lice will make a significant addition to the colony's larders. Oh. They are clinging tightly to the ground. Hello there. It's going to take some effort to dislodge them. Ah. Uh. Um. Mole crickets are burrowing into the nest. The ants must oh, defend bollocks. multiple locations at once. Oh, yay. Red, go there. Oh, man. Yeah, we're gonna need to, like, put these off immediately just into different things. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, no, 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 no. The ants must protect the queen. Ants, 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 get to the queen! Oh my god. Leave my queen alone. Leave the queen alone! There, go to turn him. One. Oh, he's dead. Okay. Kill him. It. Thing. Her. She. I don't know. The ants must protect the queen. That's what I'm trying to do. There we go. Okay. Phew. Right. And let's send you guys around there. Send you guys around there. What we do want to do is maybe focus on doing another one of these guys then. This colony must remain small for now. Food is too scarce to support greater numbers. Yeah, 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 yeah. So what I will do is split it apart so they can get to each other, but then I'll leave purple around here. Go chew through them. I mean, there is this bit here that would allow us to get to this. Alrighty. Send red in and send yellow in there. Hmm? What now? Oh, it's okay. So they can come up literally anywhere. Does that mean they're going to come up that bit and this bit then? Is that how it works, maybe? They are gathering that up, which will help us out a lot. The colony is starving. There's not enough food to feed the new brood. There you go, there is. Plenty of food. There we go. See? 
Okie dokie. Oh dear. Let's get them upgraded. The workers have done all they can to prepare this brood chamber. There's actually quite a lot still around here. Um, yous are meant to be collecting food. I was wondering why that was taking them so long. There we go, bring that round. Make sure that's upgraded so we can have plenty ample storage space. A mole cricket is burrowing into where, the nest. Where, where, where? The ants must mount a defense quickly or their brood will be forfeit. Don't you worry, we're okay, we're all there. Ready to kill? Go! The ants will fight to the death. Yeah, well, that's kind of thing. You know, you will fight to the death. Quite literally. In this enemy. Come on, come on, come on. There we go, excellent. We'll leave purple here. We'll send red around there. Put another one in there, another one there. Let's open this up. Predators are loose in the nest. The larvae must be protected. Okay, let's see. We can want to try and do some upgrades to these guys to make them a bit more powerful. Go another one down. What we could do is then bring that through. At least getting the food here a little bit quicker. Might as well get rid of that as well, actually. Another one to red, because red's going to be our main attack force and purple's going to be like the defenders. Any more? No. Okay, what do we want to go for? I think that was the main one. I'm not entirely sure now. We do have, like, 10 worker ants and 14 of these guys, so it's not like we're not, you know, got enough to do some damage. Hmm. No way to get to that otherwise, no. I feel like that might be the better way to go. Just run out until we build up our numbers a little bit so we can get this and this. Is there any way you go the, like, that way? Is it possible? Put that in there and then we shall open this all up. Predators are loose go! In the nest. Oh dear. The larvae must be protected. Oh dear. Come on, come on, come on. There's not enough of our fighters there. Tempted to bring purple round to help out. Because they seem to be winning. <laughs> Come on, red and purple and everybody, go. Oh dear. This is not good. There's not enough food to feed the new brood. There we go. Excellent. Come on. And Come on. Phew. Okay. Red, get in there. Yellow, get in there. Purple, bring Mold yourself. Are burrowing into the nest. Where? Where? The ants Where? must defend in multiple locations of oh, Red, you ready? Attack it. Kill it. Kill it with fire. Well, we don't have fire, but oh, there's a third one. Holy crap. Hello. One down. Come on, kill that one. Kill it. Kill it already, please. Yeah, that's that one down. Yeah, everybody go over there and help out. There we go. Okay. Phew. This colony must remain small for now. Food is too scarce to support great I'm gonna send yellow up into that bit along with red just now. I mean, I don't know if we're actually getting any food from them. I'm not entirely 100% sure. 
what we are going to do is go for this. See, two more for red, and then we can start building up purple a little bit more. There we go. Right, red, get in there. And yellow in there. I think we picked up all the food there, so that's okay. I'm going to put you there and you there. And then put you there. Excellent. That gives us 20 on red, and then it will give us 6 on purple. There we go. And they'll bring all that food back, and that will allow us to probably at least beef up purple to 10. But what we would want to do is get upgrades going as well. Because I don't think there's many upgrades on... Yeah, there's not many upgrades on them at all. Alright. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, can't place it. There we go. Five. That'll give us ten on purple. Just kind of sitting over there. Gather up the food. Excellent, excellent. Okay, right. Red, come over here. Wait, 11? What? Did I count that wrong? Probably. And yellow over here as well. That's all cleared out. Excellent. Oh, kill all nearby creatures. I mean, everything's bigger than you. It's not fair. <laughs> I suppose you are ants, but that's not fair. Okay, go get in there, guys. Get in there, guys. Excellent. Actually, send purple in as well. A mole cricket is burrowing oh, into what, the nest. What, where? Where? The where? Ants must mount a defense quickly, or their brood will be forfeit. Purple, you're gonna need to defend while red attacks them. Hopefully, killing them. There you go, purple. Good, good, good. Red is still attacking these guys. Purple's taking care of that. Although we don't have any starving. There's not enough food to feed. Don't worry, we've got plenty of food coming. And that's that dead, excellent. Phew. Right, let's go and get this. Guys, get in there. These are dealing with that. Excellent. Alright, we want to get purple beefed up a bit more though. That should give us... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Strength in numbers, you know? Strength in numbers. That's a lot of food we're bringing around there. Holy crap. Okie dokie. Now what we want to do is get you, you. The workers have done all they can to prepare this brood chamber. I'm gonna get some a bunch of upgrades. Hmm. Right, do we want to go for that? But yes, we do. So let's take this away. Take that all away, actually. Let's put yellow here and red there. Why is there only ten at red? Where's the rest of these? Uh, no, we do. We're nearly. Red should be all here, unless it's unless they're all turning food away or something. Probably, yeah, that's what it seems to be the case. All right, let's get in here. There are intruders in the nest. Yellow, get in here too. Come on. Red is doing okay. Now we do have upgrades on some of red as well, though. Come on. Excellent, excellent. And wait, no, there we go. They're all dead now. Excellent. That'll give us a huge chunk of food increase as well. And we're just going to pummel it into upgrades, I think. Probably should extend purple a little bit more. I'm not entirely sure, though. Oh. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. 
Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Mold Hello? Crickets are burrowing into the nest. Yes. The ants are must defend in multiple locations at once. Okay. This could be a pain. So we got that there. There's two the over there. Fight to oh, the there's death. four of them? Jeez. It's one down. Come on, guy. That's another one down. Purple, get this one from behind. There we go. Excellent, excellent. Alrighty. Red, I want you to come to here. Yellow, I want you there. Do need to do an upgrade in some purple. Seems a little unfair. But I mean, we do have in total twi uh, 36 of these guys, so that's going to help us out, no matter what. Let's get rid of that and that, just to make sure we have... Predators are loose in the nest. Go! The larvae must be protected. Go. So, anytime you see dust kicking up, make sure you just get into it, because otherwise it's going to be hell for me. There we go, another one down, another one down, and I think there's only one left, actually. Yep, there we go, excellent. Now we just have to kill this. The colony is starving. There's not enough food to feed the new brood. Right, so this is all we have left. Though, I don't trust... I wish I would tell you when the raid was coming. That'd be nice. But unfortunately it doesn't. Right, we have 99, so that's enough to replenish quite a lot as well. So, let's open this up. Predators are loose in the nest. Hello? The larvae must be protected. Then we get this bit. There we go. Kill them all. I'm not seeing anything coming in yet, which is okay. Put you there. Put you there. Because no my my luck, I'm going to take that wall down and then they're going to spawn. What might be better though is if we clear this out. As a sort of battle zone area. Because our ants do a lot better when they're able to get around things. Oh god. Hello. A mole cricket is burrowing into the nest. Ah, mole cricket. The ants must mount a defense quickly okay. or their brood will be forfeit. Just a one. It's just a one. There you go. The ants must fight. Don't worry, we're fighting. We're fighting. Uh, let's see. There we go. The thing it would be easier for if they can get to and from really, really quickly. So I'm going to place these guys here. I'm going to place these guys here, these guys here, and these guys here. You should be okay, right? Okay. Once we have sufficient numbers over here, we'll then open this up. Yeah, I think we've got more than enough there now. Let's do this. Predators are loose. Let them nest. come. Let the them come. Must be protected. Let them come. And now go for it. Go for it. Surround them. The ants have stumbled into the path of a fully developed devil's coach horse beetle. Yeah, don't it's worry. It'll be dead soon. Breakfast. The beetle is almost four times the size of a black ant. See, that's what I mean. Like, you get the surround, you do this incredible Lasted amount of damage. Of defenders, it sprays foul-smelling secretions that, from the end oh. of its raised abdomen. The there we go. The ants. The devil's coach horse is dead. Its corpse will provide food to support dozens of new brood. I really want to in who they got to do the, the narration in this because it's incredible. Right, you there, you there, and you there. Is there anything coming in? No. Okay. Someone go and chat the door. <laughs> A little ant. The spotlight's on you. Knock, knock. Predators are loose in the nest. The larvae must be protected. Let them come, let them come, let them come out. And attack with everything we have! 
Please don't be sending in this again. Please don't be sending in this again. Oh, okay. Wait, how did that get over there? I don't know. We're okay just now. It'd be better if we had three teams right now, but oh well. Oh dear. We are losing. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Oh, bollocks. Oh, God. Then Mole nightmare. crickets are burrowing into the nest. Yep. The ants must defend in multiple locations at once. Yep. And they're still coming, too. Wonderful. Ugh. There is not enough food to feed the new Oh dear. Oh dear, dear, dear. Oh, no, no, no. The reds, you're doing okay. Red, get over here. Get them. Them, kill them, kill them. Get over there. Over there as well. Over there. Come on, we can do this. We can do this. We only have to kill these two. Excellent. Oh, that's them all dead. Whew. This Formica Fusca colony has now established itself as a rising power in the undergrowth. Soon their territory will need to expand above ground, where new challenges await. For the time being, however, the Queen is safe. Well, uh, do we want any jelly or extra food? I think we want that. And we're going to end the level. Jeez, that was uh, terrifying. But that's going to give us some extra goodies that will allow us to do some things. Now, I don't know if... Progressing? The Queen is exhibiting interesting new behaviours. I believe the colony is beginning to adapt. Now, I'm wondering with this, what's it saying here? The challenge here to unlock new missions. I'm very curious... Like, you know, whatever the scientists have planned. Does that then kill your colony if it doesn't survive? That's what I'm wondering. Now, we do have some of this we can use. And we also have some DNA that we can use. So, let's have a look here. So, self-repair. When out of combat, regenerates four extra health per second. Oh, that'd be pretty cool to have. Upon dropping below 40%, retreat for 0.5 seconds. Increases attack speed by 20%. Meanwhile, reduces incoming physical damage. Ooh. So we can either increase the attack by 20% or reduce our incoming damage by 50%. You know what? I'm going to do that. That seems like a really good upgrade. And fairy jelly. This. Whilst not in combat, attacks against the worker have a 95% chance of causing no damage. As soon as damage is caused, this creature enters combat. Cannot take more than 20 damage in a single hit and reduce income. Oh, that's actually pretty good. There we go. But you can't actually do this. So there we go. That's uh, that's them um, pretty much fully upgraded, actually. But what the heck's going on up here? Oh, nothing. Nothing uh, that's too bad, which is okay. There we go, these guys are gathering that up. We have a lot of food coming in. Let's get this upgraded. And I believe... Nope, can't perch... Oh, do we not have that upgrade yet? No, that cost... Hmm. Okay, well, we don't have enough to upgrade that, but that'll be fine. Maybe. <laughs> Well, guys, I think for that, I'm going to leave it there for today. So thank you so very much for joining me for this episode of Empires of the Undergrowth. I shall see you all in the next one.